Welcome to Bangkok, 47. Ken... Welcome to the Himapan Hotel, sir. They're doing something about the coconut. Those things are crashing. Check it out. Yeah, all right. Anyway, my mother-in-law has this weird condition. It's a kind of strange trouble. We shot the brand in the morning. What the hell is that? Even their key cards to their own rooms. <laughs> it's sad and ridiculous. Mind you, I would swap places with them in a minute. <laughs> yeah, me too. I'm gonna get that package for Wes, but reception says one of our guys picked it up an hour ago. Yeah, must have been Security looking hella tight today, nice keeping it real, Ken boy. Morgan. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I can get my country back brick, on, right? Keith right. McKenzie, U.S. Attorney's Office. Uh, you know, You're no quitter. We've got to give you that. Look, I can fix this. I'm homing in on the problem. I just gotta... Damn it! Yeah. Are you sure you don't want to ride home? It's not about that. There's this guest. Big shot lawyer fella up in the Queen Suite. He's offered to buy it. This. This piece of crap for, like, an obscene amount of money. I just gotta get the engine running. A guest wants to buy your crummy old- According to the hotel gardener, Ken Morgan wants to purchase his aging tuk-tuk as a souvenir. Unfortunately for him, he can't get the engine working. Tuk-tuk. Huh. You're good at fixing things, 47. Tourists, I suggest right? you give the gardener a helping love hand. This could be know, excellent bait. I don't know, the guy wants bait. to use it as a golf cart at his Hampton Country Club or whatever. <laughs> be my guest, man. His folly is my game. <laughs> no kidding. Well, I guess I can stick around for a bit. You know, for moral support. Thanks. Good show, 47. It's time to close the deal.
how to deliver Mr. Morgan the good news. Why would someone like Jordan Cross, a multi-billionaire by birth, but his ass being a rock star? Why not just be a playboy? Good to see plenty of security here. Open, sir. Off. Yeah, the cross people. I mean, it's like they're taking over the place room by room. As if the noise was enough. Never have enough security. That's what I always say. Hi there. How you doing? So, uh, when is Dexy Barrett coming to pick me up? I don't know. I just carry the heavy stuff, man. You can head up to the studio yourself if you want. No, oh, no. I don't want to see you push it out. I'll wait. She didn't forget. So the infamous Dexy Barrett. Is it true she lives off Martini's in the traffic? Yeah, I just carry the heavy stuff. Just curious. That is Ken the Brick Morgan, lawyer and corporate fixer. I'm not sure I know you, sir. Huh? You know this fella? What's Thank you. Problem? I'm on it. Really?
I'm so sorry. Target down. Now on to Jordan Cross. Central. I'm in the bar and there's nothing going on. Yeah. What's up, Abel? I'll give you a short version of it. Nobody gets in on Oh, hey, Mr. De Silva. Dexie Barrett was supposed to pick you up at the restaurant lounge. Huh. Oh, well, while you're here, who cares? Go right in. Tell Jordan Cross he's awesome. Ready? Uh, I'm running. No, 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 no. Stop. Hey, what you left with that? Just ain't doing it for me. Stop. Right, thanks. I'm feeling a little je ne sais quoi. I, I, I don't know. I'm just, I, look, I'm just not feeling Hey, it. Mr. Silva, what's Jordan. up? Yeah, why don't you take five? You know, go grab something to drink. It'll loosen up your throat. Uh, West part of Branson, MD2? Yep. Also known as Old Spark. That is Jordan Cross, Bankrupt. revered and reviled in equal measures. Oh, hey, you're Quentin's replacement, right? Yeah, thanks for coming out. Wait, I'm compromising. Always chasing that perfect thing. He once spent six days between the spring... Everyone, this is Abel De Silva. He's here to take over for Quentin. Uh, drums all set up, Wes. Good to go. Cool. So, what do you say, man? Get behind the kit, show us what you made of. to shoot anyone from the record company who entered before the mix was just right. Yeah, well, still, I mean, to, to risk Jordan's life for a particular vocal sound that, that only he and, and a handful of people in the world were ever known. Some kind of machine, aren't you? Oh man, nicely done. Why don't you walk with me, Abe? There's something I want to show you. After you. Yeah, so sorry about the mood around here. You know, Heidi's still pissed about Quentin leaving. But, you know, just don't expect her to roll out the red carpet. So just do your thing, do it well, and she'll soften up. It's fine. Where are we going? Atrium roof. Look, I want to pitch you something. And I don't want the others to hear. It's bad. Oh, whoa, well, wait. Take care. What's up, Abel? So, I like your style. It's very tight, very new way. You, uh, you should talk to Dexy when we get back to New York. Uh, who's repping you? Small agency. Very low profile. You wouldn't have heard of them. <laughs> Old buddies from school, huh? Don't have the heart to let them go? Yeah, I thought so. Look, believe me, man. You gotta aim higher. Anyway, so I have this project coming up. Yeah? I think it's right up your alley. Going solo? Yeah, that's the plan. I could use a solid drummer. A hired gun, not a partner. Someone who does the job without getting noticed. Oh. So you're interested? It's what I do. Great, yeah. Oh, mull it over. Talk to your people if you have any. You can decide when we get back to New York. Good talking to you, Abe. Both targets down. 
Now head towards an exit. What's up? 